I think what we see in the pragmatic caucus, mayors, governors, business leaders, philanthropic leaders, university presidents, uh, is, is a affirmative vision of economic growth in the United States that's more productive. So we're not just the idea generator, but we can also produce and deploy more of what we invent, more sustainable, so that we can meet the environmental imperative of our time, but also be at the vanguard of the clean economy, which is a very manufacturing and export-oriented sector, and inclusive. So we can create not only more jobs, but better jobs that pay better wages, provide better benefits, and more accessible jobs. So that people living in a city can have access to jobs via transit. Uh, people living in suburbs can have greater access to jobs in cities. Because again, these cities and metropolitan economies are completely integrated. So what I see coming out of this pragmatic caucus is a very optimistic vision of the way the American economy can head, but they're making some hard choices and they're making some targeted investments in fiscally strapped times. And they're taking risks because that's the only way you restructure an economy as large and diverse as ours. You have to take some risks and you have to understand we're not alone in the world anymore. We're up against competitors, both mature economies like Germany but rising nations like China, India, and Brazil who look to the United States as the innovator of the 20th century but want to take our place in this century.